I'm ready to hibernate. Maybe we could find the old bear's ice cave for you. You want to sit down for a bit? Not a bad view, right? Yeah. I get now why they put cemeteries in nice spots. Takes a little bit of the sting off. Listen, I know this has been hard. I'm really grateful you saw it through with me. Fireweed was great, but there was no one really there for me like that. You know, you're the only one. Hey, brothers and sisters, right? But it's been way more brothers than sisters lately, which is why I'm trying to say thank you. You really don't have to. You saved my life, Allison. Only for you to end up locked up in fireweed for the rest of your childhood. Wait, are you still blaming yourself for that? Don't. It was my choice. It's just... I stole your life, Tyler. And then I totally wasted it. That's not true. You're on your way to Denali. Michael's gonna be a famous chef. And, and what am I doing? Nothing. Nothing. You've been working on that accounting degree. And your art's good. Really good. Stop putting yourself down. As soon as we figure this shit out, we're gonna sell the house, and you're gonna go to Juno. You're gonna kick ass. You make it sound so easy. No. We never had a shot at easy. But we always pull through, right? Yeah. You're right. Hey. Wherever Ranger Tyler ends up next, he better come down from the hills to visit us city folk every now and then. You hear? For sure. And anyway, that's not gonna be for a while. We've got time. Oh yeah, of course. We do. So I guess we know the story now, huh? Marianne was done with Delos, and Delos was done with her. Maybe she was too proud, but she worked so hard for so long, and when she reached the end of her rope, no one was there to help her. Not even Tessa. Or Eddie. And when she heard social services was coming, she... She... Gave up. But killed her kids? Really? I don't know. It still feels like there's something missing. Right? You're never gonna understand what was going through her mind. I'll bet even she didn't. It's probably always gonna feel that way. I'm gonna fall asleep the second I hit the couch. You better rally. We still have to do some cleaning before bed. Uh, do we have to? Hey, whoever packs the most gets the big couch tonight. Shit. Allison. I'll get the fire extinguisher. Are you all right? 
Allison, barn. Stay there. I got it. guy. He smashed me in the face with the door. What guy? What did he look like? I'm not sure. I couldn't see straight, and, and he was all in black. God. Why would someone try to burn down our barn? I don't know. But I'm going to find out. Did he really have to smash everything? Great. More to clean. I might have found something. Is that a box under the barn? Yeah. What the hell? I think this is where the fire started. So he was trying to burn whatever's inside? We should check it out. I'm gonna need to remove a few more planks to get to it. Hmm. Where could we possibly find a tool to do that? He went looking under the rug? Hmm. One of the valuable stuff. This gas can was already here this morning. He didn't bring it with him. Well, at least he left us the junker. Asshole really even dumped the drawers. Place upside down. Huh. At least you were spared. I guess we know how he made the hole. Back. I'll be fine. Well, I only know one person who'd bother to decorate a storage box like this. Marianne. Let's open it. What's that there? Some kind of carving. Not sure what it is, though. Hey, doesn't that carving look like the secret keeper from the Book of Goblins? Hey, doesn't that carving look- Three digits. Any ideas? Mm. Marianne was never really a numbers kind of person. That wasn't it. I think we just need to break the lock. It. Look, it's the same symbol, the secret keeper. Well, let's see if...
Ugh. Any brilliant ideas? Knowing Marianne, it's probably connected to the Book of Goblins somehow. Ugh. Any brilliant ideas? Knowing. Marianne. It's probably connected to the Book of Goblins somehow. Hey. Doesn't that carving look like the secret keeper from the Book of Goblins? Did it. I think she didn't know how much of an ass he'd turn out to be. That's everything. What the hell? So, Marianne hid a box under the barn. Box full of letters from our deadbeat dad. He turned the whole place upside down and didn't take anything. All he wanted was that box. And he was willing to burn down the barn to get rid of what was inside. You know what it all means, right? Yep. That guy had an affair with Marianne, and he just tried to torch the evidence. He must have heard we were clearing out the house. He was worried we'd find it. You know, I... I can't shake the feeling I've seen him here before.
kind of work boot? Maybe fishing boots? Straight for it. No stops, no turns. He was on a mission. Trail ends here. It looks like he jumped into the gully. Hey, are there footsteps on the other side? Yeah, that must be where he climbed out. Well, he's long gone. Did you see a car anywhere on the way home? Nope. He must have gone off road. I guess it makes sense why he was able to get in and out so fast. Yeah. He must have been out here visiting Marianne. Hey, what are you doing? Do you remember anything about his face? I couldn't see it. He had a hood on. Just like we left it. Nothing's been forced open. So he didn't try to get into the house at all. He didn't try to get in here. forgotten anything about that night. I would have said the same thing, but something felt different. I need to see the rest. I don't know what happens down there. That's the thing. I'm not sure I do. <sighs> All right. Let's go. This is where I tripped.
he really didn't want us to figure out who he was. Well, he's been avoiding us for 20 years, so... No hesitation. He knew where he was going. Someone here that night? In the woods? No. It was just... I, s I saw... Who the hell did I actually see? The Mad Hunter! What? No. That... That was the Mad Hunter. What? What are you talking about? That night, I thought I saw the Mad Hunter in the woods, but I guess it was just some asshole. Some asshole who just fucking stood there and watched while our mother chased me with a shotgun. Do you think it was the same guy? Maybe. I mean, it had to be him, right? They were wearing the same fishing gear. Yeah, unless everyone who wants to mess with us is coordinating outfits. And wait! He was here once before, wasn't he? A few days before Marianne died? Maybe? Hold on, do you feel that? Tyler, not there. Our mother fought with someone on the dock, about us. We need to know if it was the same guy. But what if it's not that memory? What if it's... I can't go through that again. We have to take that chance. But do we really? I mean, someone just tried to burn our barn down. Yeah, and that means we've got to be close to something. I'm not going on that dock. Just one more time, please. There's always just one more. Every time it seems like we're done with this, something new pops up. What if this is the only chance to figure out who our father is? Then we go on living our lives without him, just like we always have. Come on, we need to know the truth. For her. What if I don't want to know the truth, huh? Did you ever consider that? No. You just push and push and- You have to take responsibility for your part in Marianne's death. What? How, how... How can you say that to me? I didn't. But I, I did, right? Earlier, to Eddie. But I, I swear I didn't just say that to you. So we can't even trust our own voices now? God, I, I don't know. Allison. I'll do it. Let's go. out of bed. I told you, I told you that would happen. We almost had it though. That was us watching Marianne fight with that guy. Try to focus on him, all right? Don't think about anything else. I'll, I'll try.
been keeping my mouth shut? I don't owe you anything. You've been a little... all over the place lately. All over the place? I've just been trying to survive. If you want to make sure I don't get desperate, you could help us out. Lend me some money. What happened? Why did it stop? I can't, Tyler. But we were so damn close. I'm sorry, but I'm done. That's it? You're just giving up, just like that? You can't do this. We owe her. Marianne is gone, Tyler. And nothing we do is gonna change that. Don't go, please. You can't keep running from this alley, or it's only gonna get worse. Ouch! Watch it! You're stepping on my foot! Can you hear what they're saying? Quiet! We don't want Mom to catch us out of bed. There's no money. I've never asked you for anything, but right now they need you. It's not gonna happen. I've got everything I need to nail your ass in that barn. And just what do you think happens after that? What do you mean? Well, if those kids have a father, you really think there's a court out there that'll let you keep them? No! You have no claim to my children! Get the hell off my property, now! If you ever come back here, I'm going to kill you! Allison? There's something else. Look at this. What do you think? Should we give it a shot? I think the crafty goblins have one more hatch to sneak through. Let's go.